I'll be honest with you, the only reason I boot into Windows now is so I can game. So the idea of having a native Steam client for Linux would just open up a realm of possibilities that the community's never seen before. Hey, I'm Nixie Pixel, and you're watching OS Alt, your source for open source. Now, I want to talk about the state of gaming in Linux. Normally, when I say that I play Linux games, oftentimes what comes to mind is that game where instead of lemmings, they're penguins, or the dreaded Tux Racer. Not that those aren't good games, they're just completely different. I don't want to say that they're rookie games, but they're not the type of AAA titles that I think of when I think of hardcore gaming. I mean, I love me some adventure games, and I can do that on Linux, but I'm talking about Left 4 Dead, for instance, and there's good news there. I don't know if you've heard of Veronix, but it's a great resource if you're into Linux and gaming in Linux. Actually, the founder, Michael Larabelle, was invited by Gabe Newell, which is the CEO of Valve, to kind of dissect this whole gaming in Linux process. Turns out the CEO for Valve is a stand-up guy. Not only does he want a native Steam client for Linux, but also the source engine to be on Linux too. Gabe also said that they weren't really set up to develop a full Steam client in 2010 because their workflow was such where the devs were just working on it in their spare time. But we'll give them a pass this time because they're serious about it and they created a game that caused me to sequester myself in my room eating a strict diet of Slim Jims and running around with a boomstick in my hand. So that day was great for potential Linux gamers because Pharonix was able to sit down with the CEO of Valve and basically play games natively in Linux that didn't involve using the Wine Library. Michael was able to see with his own two eyes not just rumors, but actual proof about the state of gaming in Linux. And that's really great because frankly all people have been doing is blowing smoke up our ass. Anyway, now that I think about it, Mac uses OpenGL, Linux uses OpenGL, so we could just port it over, right? It's probably not that simple, but it's also probably no coincidence that Valve developed for Mac before Linux. That's okay though, now it should be easier for them, though Valve is submitting a help request asking for Linux developers that are familiar with OpenGL. And of course the Linux development team is experiencing issues with hardware, software, and drivers. What else is new? The main complaint is even with super awesome graphics cards that the Valve team has, they still can't push it above 30 frames per second. So they definitely need your help and if you're in a position to, the links are going to be in the below bar. So when all is said and done, will the Valve Corporation have said more than they've done? No, actually, they are currently working their little tushies off to get awesome games on our Linux machines. I know it's good for some, but I personally can't wait until I can say, bye bye Windows, I'm gaming on my favorite OS now. Just think of all the games that are available on Steam, there's over a thousand of them. I mean, Borderlands, Bioshock, Battlefield, no wait, that's Origin. But even EA is talking about giving support for Origin, so it's really an amazing time to be gaming in Linux, and I want to know what games you guys want to play in Linux. Let me know in a comment below, and be sure to check back next Friday, subscribe, um, for all things open source, baby. That is not what I usually say, but I love you, I love you, I'm so excited! That was a little Undead Warcraft style. Yeah! Now it's time to give my sponsors some love. Seriously though, I've been with HostGator since my first blog post in 2008. With Linux-based servers and plans starting at under four bucks a month, you get 24 seven support and access to tons of website building tools. HostGator has even gone green and is 130% powered by wind energy. Did I mention they'll even migrate your current site for free? For OS Alt viewers, HostGator is offering 25% off your order or your first month free. Just go to HostGator.com and type in the code NixieOSAlt at checkout for your discount.